reporting from Pritchard. Thank you, Alan. In other news tonight, Gulf Coast Recreational and Charter fishermen are annoyed and frustrated after a federal announcement earlier today. The 2017 Red Snapper season will only be three days. The decision comes after months of debate on Capitol Hill and here on the Gulf Coast. For more on this, News 5's Haley Minogue joins us live. Anglers are concerned tonight, Haley. Roseanne, that's right. Now, those anglers, both recreational and charter, are concerned for a number of reasons. One, of course, the local economy, and two, I mean, their livelihood. That's how they make their money. But another thing that's really concerning them is that they know that people, no matter what the weather is like, they're still going to try to go out, even if their safety is at risk for those three days. There's no theme parks here. There's no roller coasters. These people are coming here to fish, and, you know, these charter boats behind us, that's what they do. They take people out to go have fun. Anglers called it a big hit to the city's big business. Last year, federal red snapper season was nine days. This year, three days. A three-day snapper season, really. Representative Bradley Burns sent News 5 this video, but that's not the action this angler was hoping for. It, it makes you feel a little bit more justified that they're seeing it. It's just like you keep got to wonder, what, why are they doing something about it? The NOAA sets the seasons based on the number of fish they observe, but some of the locals say they're setting the days based on incomplete data. They're missing where 85% of the snapper, triggerfish, amberjack live, because they won't live on sand bottom. They're going to live on a on a house just like you will. With a third of the time they had last year, less time to fish means more things have to align perfectly. Weather being a big factor. We could have bad weather and it'll make it unsafe. Uh, that's the biggest part is, you know, there will be people, no matter how rough it is, they only got three days, they're going to try to go, and so I worry about the safety aspect of it. Alabama will be opening their state waters May 26th until July 31st. In Florida, state waters open one day later than Alabama and are open 78 days. We have several resources on our website that you can look at that let you know about the state the state seasons for fishing for red snapper where you can go up to nine miles off the coast without going into federal waters. So head over to WKRG.com to see those dates for not only Alabama, but for Florida, Texas, and Louisiana as well. Reporting live in Orange Beach, I'm Haley Minogue, News 5. Now on news